This is the Skeleton Coast, one of the driest places on Earth. We think this is open enough for us to spot lion at distance. We're in pretty desolate country now. The Skeleton Coast trip may well deteriorate. Huge disaster. Pretty low on water. Fuel. That one's closed as well. Bad news. This was our scheduled fuel stop. And it's deserted. Good morning. Pretty cold in the desert. Today we're going to the Skeleton Coast. Pack this away. Everyone excited. Fly free onto Stone City and then the Skeleton Coast. I need to show you this place, it's incredible. Just stopped for a wee break, as you do. Um, we're in pretty desolate country now, and we did a little stock take, did we not, James? And we realised we're pretty, we're on a knife edge. Pretty low on water, fuel, fuel energy. medicine, <laughs> energy. But uh, we're 200 kilometres away from fuel, half a tank. We've got a bottle of water each. We're hoping to come across water before that. It's also extremely hard to drive on this. Mm. It's a, a desert shop. No, desert shop. Yes. So the des desert shop sells crafts and stones, and it looks like we might need a permit to get into the actual oh, shop. Oh, the Skeleton Coast Park. Well, let's see what happens. That makes sense. Let's see if we can get through. This might not be very good. Quite chilly. Yeah, it's not warm. That's ten. Good. That's Thank okay. you very much. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. Okay, we've just been through the entrance to the Skeleton Coast National Park. Um, we had our car searched as well because they have big problems with poachers here. So you get kind of frequently stopped and searched actually. Um, but that's all right. And um, we've also bought a little rock, crystal rock. It's a little boy by the side of the road. And now we're driving through the Skeleton Coast and running out of fuel. Yeah, there was no fuel or water at that sh shop. Just yeah. stones. They're, they have desert adapted lions in this national park. It's the only place in Africa that you can uh, see the free road in. Yeah. Guys, we had to stop for this. We had to stop for this. This is insane. It's like we're on Mars. This is the Skeleton Coast, one of the driest places on Earth. And we think this is open enough for us to spot lion at distance. This deserves a picture. It's like driving on Mars Earth, and this place is insane.
Not if you're quiet. There's no sound. No sound. James, you drive. I mean, they don't call it skeleton coach for nothing. This looks like a huge, maybe elephant hip. It's huge. That's these guys have been entranced by another craft market. No, it's look at these teeth on that skeleton. What do you think it is? Cow or something? That's not a cow. Uh, kudu. It's not a kudu, it's huge. Is this the skin that's, that's been Ugh. Right. Right, guys, let's go. Let's go. I'll see you on the other side of the gate. Bad news. This was our scheduled fuel stop, and it's deserted. She's found petrol, mate. Really? Yeah. Turns on a handle. I think this is. I think we're fucked. How far to the next section? 100k. She can do it. She can do it. She can. We've got a quarter of a tank. What about our water? <laughs> <laughs> She'll do it. Can I kick it? Hello. <laughs> I may seem a little low on energy because I've eaten nothing since small rice at breakfast. <laughs> so hungry, but we've taken a small detour for reasons unknown. Here. So this here. When I open the door, just watch my face because it <laughs> Thanks. And tell me what you think it is. <laughs> it's a seal colony. <coughs> I'm actually finding it really hard to breathe. <laughs> oh my god, it's horrible. Well, she could open. It's in her prime. They're so cute, but they're so stinky. <laughs> oh, there's some really cute little babies over there. Hey, what's happening here is there's a lot of mums and a lot of babies. And what you can hear is a lot of babies crying, basically, because they're not getting fed. What are you shouting at? Let's get out of here. It sounds like a massacre is occurring. <laughs> Never heard sounds like this in my life. <laughs> also, is this seal hair? Oh, I think it is. Across the wreck. I think it's called the Zilia or the Zela. Zilia. It's out there. Crashing around in the waves. So let's go and check it out. James is in trouble, as you can see, he's been surrounded by potential sellers of something or other. <laughs> he's valiantly protected us so he could get some snaps. See if we can protect him. Shall we go? You guys don't want any rocks, do you? Oh no, I'm good on rocks, thanks. You don't want a rock? We make like this, we make like this. We make like this. These two? For me and my brother. You want a rock? No. <laughs> James has made a purchase. What's up, boyfriend? 
I feel bad though, like. <laughs> He's trying to swap some glasses. James has got a boyfriend. I have got the deal of the century. I did tell my mum I'd get some gemstones. So did I you? Did. Oh my god! <laughs> Guys, we think the hunt for petrol is over because we're entering this little town with potentially three petrol stations. Each one offering its amber liquid up to <laughs> our wonderful vehicle. The nectar for old Pumba. Old Pumba. Look at the fuel gauge though, we're pretty close to the bone. There it is. Oh, there's two. Oh. It's like a <laughs> bus. <laughs> Come on, there's gotta be. Come on. It's closed, James. Oh my god, no. Outside. Oh shit. That one's closed as well. Oh, what the fuck? Yes, there's another one. There's a Puma. Yes! Oh, it's open. It's open. Third time lucky. Or fourth time, if you include that with the place we tried. Hi! Hi! Hi. Saviors, we thought we would never get any fuel around here. <laughs> hey guys, so we've made it safely to Swakopmund. We found our Airbnb. It's lovely. We're staying there for two days and you would not believe how happy we are to be staying in a real bed with real bathrooms and all that stuff. Oh, luxuries of civilization. Um, so yeah, we didn't run out of fuel, we didn't run out of water, we found a pit stop on the way and fueled up and made it all the way here. Now we're having a fancy dinner. Enjoying my last day of being 25. Hey guys, we are about to go to sleep. This in... one is so tired, look at him. We're about to go to sleep in Swakopmund. So it's the end of this video, it's the end of the day, we survived. It was probably the most amazing drive I've ever done. It's probably one of the most amazing drives on earth. It was so beautiful. Yeah, like, just indescribably beautiful. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, write something below, give it a like with some good karma, and remember to subscribe. Love you guys, thank you for watching. We'll be back tomorrow. Bye. Good night.